it's hard to take it all in at once. It just seems surreal to sort of go back and follow the whole story. It wasn't an easy life, and, and I think that was the hard road that really paved the way of how hard this sport was going to be and the pain that one would endure. His commitment towards his sport is exceptional. His drive has shown how successful he's become. He's defined by his passion for bike riding. It speaks volumes about the heart that he has and the compassion that he has, not only for his sport, but for those around him. I've always been competitive my whole life. I was that way since I was a, a little kid. And you know, you, you could even say it started from when I fell in love with the sport at the age of 13. And you know, I never, never even knew what, what existed back then or what choices I would have to face. He raced in the wrong era because he raced in the Lance Armstrong era. If there hadn't been a Lance Armstrong around, Levi Leipheimer would have been the greatest Tour de France rider from the United States from his era. You only get one chance as a professional cyclist. That's the life of a pro bike rider. One mistake, and you're out. If you get too emotional about everything, it's just too hard. You're like a salmon swimming upstream against your emotions. I guess I think more about how I want to look back on it, and then, you know, there was something on the other end of that that made it all worthwhile.